Just in case you experience the same error with the same scenario that I had, this may be of help. Otherwise, it may not be. So I was trying to install on Windows Server 2019 SQL Server, and it worked fine under my Enterprise Admin account, but it didn't work under a privileged access management account that did have local administrator privileges. So the error I got when trying to install it, it said this operation has been canceled due to restrictions in effect on this computer. Please contact your system administrator. And if I did a hold down the shift, right click, run as a different user, even if I keyed in those same PAM credentials, I still got the same error. If I tried it from a PowerShell, I was able to get one step further, but ultimately it would fail. I don't know why. And it would happen with all the accounts from that particular smart group for privileged access management. It was as if I didn't have admin privileges on the box is really how it was behaving, but I was able to install other software, just not SQL. So here's what I did to kind of get around it. I went into reg editor, registry editor, reg edit, went to H key current user software, Microsoft windows, current version policies, explorer. And I deleted disallow run. Once I did that, I was able to, and I just completely deleted disallow run. You know, now that I'm doing this video, I realize I probably should have just changed the value from one to zero, but I completely deleted it. So, and once I did that, I was able to install the software without problem. This may end up helping you fix a different problem or potentially gain you administrative access to a server you probably shouldn't have access to, but I needed it. I am the administrator and I couldn't install under the account and I needed to be able to. Anyway, that's how I did it. Thanks for watching. This is Technuba.